in the heart of the national capital delhi breathing has become increasingly challenging despite diwali being for few days away the oppressive air quality has led people to stay indoors the air quality index has surged beyond 400 aqi in light of the severity of the situation today we have with us professor anjal prakash who is an environmentalist he will give some insights on this situation welcome sir thank you so much uh, uh, superna for having me so the issue of stubble burning in neighboring state is often cited as a major contributor to delhi's pollution what steps can be taken to address this issue effectively are there successful international models or case studies that delhi ncr can learn to address its pollution crisis yeah there are many many case studies and let me just go back uh, you know closer home is beijing china and i'm personally been there in the high time of air pollution and they have done something which is which we can learn from so beijing face severe air pollution, uh, air pollution similar to and has made significant progress in uh, implementing major emission standards expanding public transportation and promoting um, uh, electric vehicles they also have enhanced green spaces and delhi actually can learn from beijing experience in in controlling pollution through policy interventions in the urban planning process that's number one there are some other small small experiments which has happened let me just lay them out for you uh, and for your viewers um, uh, second is about you know we have london's uh, uk so london's congestion plan um, they have actually charged extra um, an ultra low emission zones that is what they have uh, they made it um, and it has reduced vehicle emissions and improved air quality and within certain times you have to pay higher tax to enter london uh, you know you are forced to take public transport because of this um, and i have traveled to london during this time and uh, it's very 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 well implemented so there we can consider similar congestion pr pricing measures to low emission zones to discourage use of pollution polluting vehicles so that's something that you can learn from london then we have bagota in colombia and bagota's bus rapid transport system has actually improved public transportation and reduced traffic congestion offering a model to delhi and uh, you know ditch congested road and lower emissions now the B brt has not worked in delhi but in other places brt has worked very well so we have to just see with a pinch of salt what is that we can we can see and we can implement then copenhagen denmark uh, is one example where they have emphasis on cycle infrastructure and they made pedestrian friendly urban design that has made it one of the world's most bike friendly cities in the world uh, delhi can actually prioritize motorized uh, transport to, uh, to reduce uh, pollution uh, hyderabad for example actually just made a very long cycle track um, uh, and uh, and uh, this is also they are making efforts to uh, bring down the pollution uh, with the uses of pedestrian uh, walking as well as cycling uh, infrastructure so this infrastructure is needed um, and lot many people want to do it but they just because it's so dangerous to to uh, to cycle in some areas that they are not do, able to do it. then last point is about los angeles we have a uh, la's experience in tackling smog uh, through stringent emission standards promoting electric vehicle and public awareness campaign uh, that offered um, valuable lessons for delhi's um, uh, efforts to combat pollution so these are these are five six example which we can actually learn from and implement it uh, the key lessons for delhi ncr includes i i would say if i have to summarize uh, implementing stricter emission standard investing in public transportation and cycling infrastructure adopting congestion pricing promoting electric vehicles and fostering green urban spaces these are the points that they must take forward